Yeah. If the next time you got to get some kind of developmental squad going because if this is happening right now, it's going to happen in the future. So just get a developmental squad going. And if I drop my phone again, you're going to have a problem. Um. Oh, by the way, I got a new case for my phone. You know, I figured it this way. It's a nice case too. I tell you, it's just it's one of these cases here. Look, you just it fits right over the top. See? And the reason I like it. It's a white phone. It deserves a white case. I had a black case before. Whatever. Nonsense. But anyway, it fits right in the boat. Um, Fox News and the news out there are saying now that this guy that went on a shooting rampage, played like 16 hours of Call of Duty, Black Ops 2, and they're blaming it on video games now. No! You blame this shooting at the shipyard on this guy being a social introvert, social degenerate nerd. That's what he was! I play Call of Duty. I play video games. I don't go around thinking I'm going to do something like that. This guy was a social degenerate nurse. You have to understand something. For every Yahoo that commits one of these crimes, you blame it on the fucking game. There's 900 million motherfuckers that don't do this type of shit. So it ain't the fucking game. If it was a game, there'd be 900 million crimes like this. The bottom line is, this guy was a social introvert, social degenerate nerd. He had no capabilities to function in the real world. He had no capabilities to function outside of video games. That's what the problem is. So he played 16 hours a night online. He probably got his ass beat online. He sucked at the game anyway. Most people that play 16 hours a night online are fucking social degenerate introvert nerds. And they're terrible. But that in no way is the reason why this dumbass went on a killing rampage in some Navy shipyard. He went on a killing rampage because he's 30-some years old. He's a social degenerate nerd that obviously had problems, underlying problems, when he grew up. Look, I'm a sociopath. I am. I hate humans. I hate people. I don't like being around anybody. I like to be alone. In fact, if it was I Am Legend, I was the last person left on fucking Earth, it'd be the greatest thing in the world. But I do not do what this guy does. This guy has a problem with reality. He can't function in society. No reality got to him. So what does the dumbass do? He goes out and does this in Fox News trash file. He's getting a pretty good. Call of Duty has not made anyone kill each other. Never. Ever. 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 This guy was a social degenerate nerd. And until you news companies out there, agencies, I don't know if it's Fox News or whoever, realize that this isn't a time or place to blame a fucking senseless video game on a fucking murder. Like I said, do the numbers. One guy commits a crime, you cry foul. Well, why aren't there 999 million motherfuckers playing Call of Duty? Why haven't they went off? You gotta accept the facts. Whoever said this, whichever news, I believe it was Fox News outlet, you always try and file on video games. So let me ask you something. Donkey Kong came out in the Atari 2600 back when I was a youngster. Did I go to a fucking Walmart? Did I try climbing up aisles and throwing shit down like a motherfucking ape? No. Okay? Gaming does not influence anybody. What influences people are their inability to communicate with real people in a social degenerate society. They can't do it. So you know what this guy did? This guy had no life. He had no odd. He said, you know what? I'm going on a rampage. I don't give a fuck what happens. And then I'm going to take my own life. But I think the police shot him. So, the news agencies, you need to fucking pipe down. As soon as something happens, you blame it on video games. And look, I'm not even a gamer. I'm not even a fucking gamer. But I do play Call of Duty. I do. You just got to accept the facts that it's over. Your news agency that's reporting this type of stuff, you obviously have no capabilities to report real news if you blame it on video games. Okay? Asteroids. An asteroid hit the Earth. Oh, my God. It's a fucking video game. They made a video game in 1985 on Atari. Asteroids hit the fucking Earth. You're going to blame that on a video game, too? Huh? Huh? You gonna blame that on the video game? Is that what you're gonna fucking do? Or are you gonna blame a car wreck at a NASCAR race on Dodgem? Because Dodgem was a racing game. You ran around this little maze in your car. You collected these dots. Are you gonna blame that? Fox News and all these news outlets, you need to leave it alone. Give it a rest. You've been by far chaponed. Anyone that's been with me a while on YouTube from 2008 knows what that means. Chaponed. You just gotta accept it. Uh, you know, a lot of people will probably wonder why. You want me to bring you GTA gameplay again today? I will, but there's been an influx of fucking gameplay on YouTube of GTA 5. So, what I'm doing is I just make my chair vlogs, whatever, what have you. That's what I do. I was gonna give you some pics of World Soccer League, but you know what? I think the games, I don't know if I have time, but I will do the English Premier Soccer League and I will do my National Football League picks tomorrow. <laughs> It's over here. Should have notified me I put it over there, you dumbass.